All right, so this is gonna be a short video. Um, if you've been having problems with your cable, internet, TV, or whatever, um, we have Comcast, and every, like before, we were having intermittent issues with our internet, on and off and on and off. Um, so if you wanna fix it, this is usually what's happening. Um, you will want to make an appointment with Comcast to do this eventually, but um, usually what happens is, is, is as you can see, um, these connections we have, they have these rubber um, pieces here, okay? So this is the updated style. Before they just have like these little, if you see that metal part, it'll look like, like that, just those metal um, bolts or nuts or whatever. And that's usually how they'll have it. It's not weatherproofed. So over time what happens is the, the rain, um, just the cold, the heat, the temperature changes, the weather causes this to get some corrosion on it. So if you can find where your cable is coming in, as you can see, there's like wires coming here. Um, but if you can find where it's coming in, one of my customers, I crawled under their attic and then found out where the wires were going out to the outside of their house. But basically you look for that and these connections you just want to loosen them uh, you might need pliers or something but you basically just undo them twist them and then tighten them back up do that like two three times that'll scrape off any corrosion that's on the inside and once it gets cleaned up you'll actually fix your connection issue um, that's assuming that it's this this is the issue um, we've had when we had the issue we changed routers we changed modems and the issue would always come back so that's where we found out that this was the issue we had one guy come out they had people come out multiple times and then finally one guy that's been there for like long time several years he was like okay um i'm pretty sure it's this and that's what i found out i had a customer that had an issue before i basically just uh went outside found where their connection came into the house and then I just uh, undid all these screws and then tightened them back up blew off the dust that was underneath and yeah you can use like a toothbrush or something and s scrape it but be careful with the little pin on the inside the copper one you don't want to damage that and once you do that if that solves the issue um, then you know for sure it's it's this connection that goes outside your house um, you'll want to call Comcast and then tell them that the the connectors outside are bad and you need some of these weatherized um, uh, I don't know what you would call it but yeah uh, that way at least you can get your internet up and running so you can use it um, and then yeah and then in the meantime you can wait for Comcast because once you scrape that off it'll take a while for it to get bad again alright so hopefully this video helped you guys if it did please like and subscribe help others find this video help them fix their stupid cable internet problems that people that the the representatives will just send you all over the place ship you like a new router modem or whatever and it won't solve your issue and yeah alright thanks for watching let others know bye